Hey Premunchers, it's your helpful zombie girl here and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited! Today we are going to do something I am have been waiting days to do because I was waiting for my Able Sisters shop to open. I am beginning my new series. It's a weekly series I'm going to do called Creator Spotlight. We will dive into creators in Animal Crossing New Horizons who are out there designing some amazing things for us and that we are able to access through the Able Sisters Taylor Shop program thing, the pro designs. Um, and so we can actually do this either by looking up IDs, design IDs, or creator IDs. So let's go ahead and hop right into this. By the way, I will put all creator IDs down in the comments below in the order that we go through them. So let's begin. First, let's take a look at Jim. Initially, I saw Jim's creations on Twitter. I saw these two amazing patterns. As you can tell, they've done a stone and then a brick pattern. But not only did they create two really gorgeous patterns that you can lay down on the ground and create some very cute trails and paths, they also have some really adorable pro design clothing creations. And so here we take a look at a couple of them. They're very pretty, very well done. I mean, seriously, this is just the cutest stuff. So um, definitely go check out Jim. As you can see, their creator code is down in the left hand side of the corner or you can check down below in the description. So next we're going to check out a creator whose name I cannot say. I'm so sorry, but of course the creator is the creator ID is down below. They've made some amazing patterns that we can actually use to hang on the wall to look like shelving or like this little butterfly collection. Absolutely gorgeous, so creative, and I really couldn't wait to show you this creator. They've also taken the time to create a custom pro design dress here, and I thought that was really adorable. So next we have Elliot. They have this one set of creations, which are cherry blossom textures. And as you can tell, they go from like a bunch down to just a few. Whenever the cherry blossoms come out in the trees, we can create some really fun designs on the ground, maybe a picnic area. Next from TJ, we have these two adorable wall prints. Um, one is a collection of butterflies and another is called Cryptid Corner and I thought that was really adorable. They also have three pro design creations that I think are super, super cool. Um, Rancho Island has to be one of my favorites. It has a picture of a tarantula on the back. I mean, that is so <laughs> freaking fun and just very creative. They also have a dress called Frog Time that has a cute little frog that hangs out the front. So you definitely want to check out what TJ has got going on over there. Next we have, it's either Giordi or Giordi, I am so sorry, but I was initially drawn to this creator because they have this wooden moss path and oh my gosh, I cannot wait to play around with this and make some really fun designs on my island. They also have a magical path and then they have a cute little blushies and freckles pattern. If you didn't know, you can actually create patterns and put them on your face. So a lot of people are using that um creation tool to make eyebrows and freckles and stuff like that. Next from Teddy, we have a collection of adorable outfits, uh, pro design outfits. They have a Teddy overall dress that I thought was so cute. Um, it's a balloon hem dress and it's just so precious. They also have a couple of other animal themed outfits. This cat overall dress is to die for. Around the waist is like a kitty collar bow. How creative is that, man? Come on, that is just too cute. Not to mention a matching Teddy hat for that dress. So you definitely wanna go check out Teddy. So next we have Lily, and Lily had these amazing stepping stone patterns that I really wanted, but when I went ahead and checked out their pro designs, they had such cute springtime filling outfits. These are so fun. I think they're really cute for especially bunny, the bunny event that's coming up. You can dress up in your cute little outfit and go have fun at the event. These dresses are so precious. Um, like this bows and suspenders, that is so cute. I love it so much. So definitely go check out what Lily has going on in their custom shop. 
All right guys, so these were the creators that I decided to spotlight for my very first um, weekly creator ID spotlight for Animal Crossing New Horizons. I have so many more that I've already looked through that I'm obsessed with that I will be featuring. If you yourself are a creator with a creator ID and you have some items already up, please go ahead and drop them in the comments below or you can send them to me on Instagram. You can share them with me. Um, my link to Instagram is down below. I'm finding a lot of creators through Twitter and Instagram. So that's mainly where I'm looking. I'm looking through the hashtag AC NH designs. Um, so I'm out there hunting. I'm hunting for creators because I love these custom designs. I think this tool is so awesome. And I think people get to be so amazingly creative and we get to share in it. How special is that? That. So yes, thank you guys so much. I really hoped you enjoyed this. If you did, leave me a thumbs up. And if you're not already, please consider hitting the subscribe button to become a brain mentor. We're definitely going to be seeing more Animal Crossing um, videos from me because I am enjoying the heck out of myself. So again, I want to thank you guys so much for checking me out and for enjoying this video. Please go out there and give props to these creators. I don't. I really wish that Animal Crossing would kind of add like a thank you type of thing where you can like heart the item or send a thank you or send them a peach or an apple or something as a thank you for their amazing creativity and sharing it with us okay guys thank you again i'm zombie girl and i will see you later